vacation I'm just gonna show you like the makeup stuff that I'm gonna bring and I always bring way too much stuff anyway but here's what my my things are that I'm gonna bring um, this one right here is not really makeup related so I'm not gonna mention that stuff in there but um, this little thing was from obviously my glam right there so it's a brush holder and these are the brushes that I'm gonna be bringing because these are, these are the ones that I currently use all the time. You can see there's eyeshadow on all of them. I use this one actually to line my lower lash line. I use that one all the time. This is like my favorite brush, an angle brush. So those are the brushes and here's a couple more. See, it's dirty. My e.l.f. brush that for my, con um, my foundation and then this is just for powder. And then I have these two mascaras. They're both by May Maybelline, the Colossal and the Falsies Volume. I wanna get the new one, the one in the teal container. I wanna try that one. And I just have um, this Milani, let's see, what it, where is it? I think it's dark brown. It's an eyebrow pencil. I love this one, this one's great. And it has a little spoolie on the other end, which I never use. I like this one, obviously, you see it's full of my eyebrow color. And then there's like some cotton balls in here. And what is that? Eye drops and some headphones. Don't ask. They were there and I stuck them in there. And then I have this new um, Revlon color stay. It's the Whipped. And I really like this. This one is not my exact color match, but um, they didn't have mine in the store. So I'm going to be using this one. And I don't know if I might bring my liquid one to kind of mix it up and change my shade in here to make it a little better. I haven't decided. Um, one lip liner I'm bringing. And this is just a cheap one, a Jordania, whatever. I don't know how to say it. And it's in Latte. And then an e.l.f. Um, liquid eyeliner pen, and it's waterproof. These are really good. It's only a dollar, and you can't beat that, and it gives you the blackest line. It's pretty cool. The only thing is, I mean, for a dollar, they dry out really quickly, but um, they work really well. And that's how the tip is. You see, mine is bent. I've had this one forever. So... And then this NYX matte cream, lip cream, and it's in Stockholm. I like these. I put like some, um, what do you call it, like some chapstick or lip balm or something underneath it. Like this one here, this Pearlese. I usually use um, like Carmex or something like that, but this is what I have here. At least, you know, to kind of show you. I mean, I have like tons of chapsticks and the Neutrogena one is really really nice which I'll probably end up using my Neutrogena one which I had in a prior video I think it's in my giveaway video don't forget my giveaway is still going on when I come back it's going to end so I don't know if by the time I put this up it'll be over but and then just one black eyeliner and this one's from MAC and actually this is like one of my first MAC things and I still have it here it's in black line Here. I really like this. This is only a dollar too, and you know what? To me, in my opinion, it works. It lasts, makes my shadow last the whole entire day, and it's one dollar. And if you haven't tried it and you haven't used it, I definitely suggest you go and use it and try it out. It's only a dollar. What are you going to lose? A dollar versus 16, 17, 20, whatever, how much dollars those high end ones are. And I've used several of the high ends, um, I've had samples of them. And I like them, but um, the e.l.f. is a dollar and it works just exactly the same in my opinion. Um, and then I got this one. It's the white eyeshadow base from NYX. And I, after I used the e.l.f. one, I just put this one on my lid only. Just um, so that when I use the colors, they kind of pop out a little bit. And then I got this in one of, in my Crave box. And this is just um, a hydrating spray on your face. It feels so good and it smells so good. This is the best thing ever. I said that about their cleanser too. They make really good stuff. Really, really expensive, but really good stuff. <clears throat> uh, okay.
Okay, and then this is an eyeshadow palette that I use. It's got makeup on the bottom that I use all the time, and it's in, or neutral eyes. I'm sorry, neutral eyes. And you can see the colors here, which I am. Oh, there goes my camera. Um, I really like them. I mean, obviously, you can tell which ones I like the most. So this one I use as an all over, all the time, obviously. And then this one is the one I use in like in the corners of my crease to darken that up. That's those are the two that I use most of time, most of the time, always, always, practically every day. So and I got this such a long time ago, and it comes with the eyeliner that came in here was so 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 good. I wish it didn't run out. It was so good. Um, and then it comes with the brush, two-handed brush, which <clears throat> I really like this brush a lot. And I just kind of use one side for this color and then I flip it over and use another side for the pink. I like this. It lasts all day. It feels really nice. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I have this one just in case I wanted to use another color. I only brought two of them. Um, so it's a bronze smoky look. It doesn't have any colors or anything like that. It just looks like that. <laughs> Obviously, that's my favorite one. And then I use this one a lot and this one so these three basically and then it has i think it has a lip thing look how dirty it is but you know what that's how i use it every day so whatever i've never used this i tried it out and i didn't like it it's just there hiding out in the wings i guess if i needed some desperate um tools here i could use them and then this little elf complexion perfection just looks like that and this is just to mattify it that's all I use it for I mean it doesn't have any color oh most importantly primer I just started using this one and I actually I like this one and it's fairly cheap I think it was less than five bucks at CVS and the NYC so it's really good it does its job so that's what more can I ask for I've been, I use, I don't know, I like a thousand different primers. So probably, I don't know, I'll probably use another one because I keep trying new primers to see which one I like the best. There's so many. Um, this one, since I'm going to theme parks and everything, I figured I'd take this with me. This came in my glam bag. People were talking so much stuff about it, but I mean, I'm just going to put it like in my T-zone only and then put my primer on top. I haven't had any reactions to it, thankfully. And then just a little tiny bag, and I actually have another makeup removing cloth or whatever you want to call them um, somewhere else in my luggage. And some polish removers. I got these as samples somewhere. I think I just got them as a free sample from their website on Facebook or something like that. So a face cleanser, makeup remover, and nail polish remover. And I have so many of these, um, not this brand, but other brands of nail polish removers that I've gotten as samples or something like that. So I'm going to be bringing all of those with me. And as far as makeup, that's basically all that I have. And this is just a little bag that um, I haven't the slightest idea where I got it from. That's my little makeup carry bag. It's a toiletry bag, but I've converted it over to makeup. That's it. Thank you so much for watching and bye-bye.